Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray, and my partner ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk is Stuart Robson. And a lot to be excited about because coming up for you, action from Ligue 1. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. And he's in the clear. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And Lionel Messi does the rest. He strikes it so cleanly. He hits it with power and accuracy. There's no stopping that one. Lionel Messi, Messi, and a goal, the quick one too, and they've turned this game on its head. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Lionel Messi! Oh, he's given the ball away. Nuno da Costa. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Messi. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. On well, attacking possibilities. Pirama Toure. Oh, it might be. He's blocked it. Good looking move, this. Danger averted. Gautier 1. Well, PSG doing well to regain control of the ball. What a save! Let's see about the delivery. That's fine goalkeeping to hold on to the corner. Mbappe. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Pirama Toure. Well, half time almost upon us, and playing away from home isn't bothering them in the slightest. Stuart, how about your take? Yes, it's been a really energetic display from them so far. The passing's been sharp, the movement from the front players has been excellent, and the finishing has been clinical. They will certainly be happy going in at half time. Well, he let them go on, but now he's going to deal with the yellow card situation. Yeah, and he was always going to be booked for that challenge. It was a poor one, you have to say. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. 
Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Lionel Messi! And saved by the keeper. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Not really the ideal clearance. And in the end, no damage done. Oh, he's through here. Could reduce the deficit. And he does. There was hope for them, despite the adversity they suffered earlier. Well, here it is, 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. Now the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Messi. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. There it is, two to the good now, and that gives them a buffer. Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so clearly. It's a fantastic strike. And the referee blows his whistle. It's half-time here. And so far, so good for Paris Saint-Germain. Well, we talked about their scoring record at the start of the game, and it's been the same old story today. Far too strong, far too dynamic for their opponents, and clinical when they've had the chances too. I just can't see there being a response, if I'm honest. So underway once again, and still reflecting on a sumptuous first-half performance from Paris Saint-Germain. Well read to ease the pressure. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. They need to get bodies back. Well, it fizzled out. Promising pass. Now he must favour the cross. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. They're going for the short one. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Nuno Menj. Gautier 1. Takes on the shot. Well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. Kylian Mbappe. Nuno Menj. They've given it away. Uh. in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here cutting in what can he do from this position now this could really lift spirits what an important piece of defending PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front favouring the short one Takes the shot. 
You certainly can't fault them for trying as they keep the pressure on. Well, that was a decent effort, and you just sense the goal's coming here. Into the final 20 minutes. No, high quality defending. Well, those stats tell us that PSG haven't dominated the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Defended well. And Changama. And he's broken free! And he read it well defensively. Lionel Messi and collected tidily he had plenty to think about no nonsense clearance Toure Gideon Mensa. Pirama Toure. And we've entered the final five minutes. And that puts them in position. Save, but still a chance. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. So making the substitution now. It comes to absolutely nothing. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, we talked about their ability to score goals at the top of the game, and once again they delivered. For me, they're always looking for the most dangerous pass, which is a great example to teams that keep possession for the sake of it. I think they're a joy to watch at the moment.